Hello, I'm Jacqueline Laflamme. I'm a professional artist with JacquelineLaflamme.com. In this clip, I'm going to give you some tips on acrylic painting techniques. You will need a canvas. You will need acrylic paint. You will need paint brushes. We're going to start off with some red paint and we're just going to start painting an apple. And as you can see, I have the consistency of the paint a little bit smoother. I've added just a little bit more um, of a watery effect to it. So I'm just going to start filling in my apple. And you can really play with acrylic paints with different consistencies from making it thicker or thinner depending on the subject matter that you're painting. So I'm just going to fill in the apple here. Now we're going to work a little bit on making some highlights and contrasts. So we're just going to start blending in a little bit of black and a little bit of green mixed together. So you see I'm just going to put a, just a tiny touch a little bit of black here just to start getting our, our shadows into the apple. And I'm going to let that dry for a few minutes and then I'm going to go over it with a little bit of red. So I can start. See this is almost dry now. That's the beauty of acrylic paints. And then almost with a dry brush technique you can go over it and just blend that in nice and smooth. You have to work pretty quickly with acrylic paints. So now you see how we're getting a nice three-dimensional effect to the apple and it's really starting to come to life. Then we're going to do a little bit of highlighting on it. I have a little bit of a lighter pink and red mixed in. And we're just going to go up here and see, just with a little bit of pink, we're going to start highlighting the top of this apple to give it that effect. And you want to just keep on blending your paint in and working that paint in slowly but surely and eventually you'll have a nice apple. This is Jacqueline Laflamme. Thank you for watching.